strikes. Right now, Rox is struggling with the strike zone. Here's a double play ball, handled easily by the shortstop who was playing up the middle to Smith, and safe at first. The first baseman, Anders, was off the bag. So this will extend the inning as this is a routine double play ball, six unassisted as Smith gets it, steps on the bag. The throw carries offline a little bit. Anders looked back. He went back to hit the bag. Looked like he might have been on the bag at the beginning. We get a great view of it right here as his knee misses it. Does he get a piece of it? Tough to tell. Tough to tell from that angle right there. I'll tell you what, the shortstop Smith with belt running. Belt wasn't sliding. And he threw that, and you're taught to throw it. Hey, if he's not going to slide, put it at his head. That's exactly right. And in college baseball, much different than you can't hit a infielder around second base. You can't take him out, as you hear in RC and pro ball. And you're supposed to get out of the way and not affect the throw. And that throw to first base. And Anders went down to one knee, and when he went down to the knee, his back foot came off of the bag, and then he went back to try to get it again. Right back up the middle. Smith, who has an outstanding arm, steps on the bag there. Belt is starting to get down, just gets out of the way. And I really think that messed him up. I think he was trying to avoid Belt. Yeah. So now you have first and third. It extends the inning. It's not really an error on the play. We get a great chance to see it again. As you can see, Smith, he hits the bag with his left foot, comes up, just misses Belt's head. And the throw with that great arm is down and away. Anders does a great job just to catch it, but he couldn't find the bag.